So when CPU mining, one of the questions that can come up is, I want to mine, but I don't want to use up 100% of my CPU. Just want to do it in the background a little bit. And, you know, with nice, nice hash, it's real good at just, you know, eating up your entire processor. Um, but something you can do with nice hash that you may not be aware of is that you can manually configure and run it from the command line. So, for example here, going into the configuration document, you can actually tell it to you know, use just four threads. Two threads, six threads, eight threads, how many threads you need. Um, and that stuff is found inside of the uh, app data roaming nhm2 bin xmr stack cpu folder and there you'll see the exe and a config file with the number zero and that's kind of a base file that it creates for you that you can use to edit to make it do what it is you want to be doing so in my case i uh let me just end this here in the command line, I just have the command with the configuration file after it. In this case, I have the number six, which means I'm doing six cores in this case. I also have ones for lower number of cores, down to two. I just did in even numbers for fun. But something you'll find... Um, when actually looking at your hashing, depending on the number of cores, the hash per second is not linear. Uh, two cores, I got 70. Four cores, I got 85. Six, 104. Eight, 116 hash per second. So as you increase the number of cores, the hash per second per core goes down. CPU percentage stays pretty consistent between my four samples incrementing by about 25% each. So, you know, they're really, between using two cores and four cores, not really a big difference um, in terms of what you're going to get, which isn't much. But, you know, only using two out of eight cores with this i7 that I have, uh, less of an impact to what I'm doing in the foreground while well, this runs in the background. No, just something to try. And since I'm using it anyway, that extra little one watt or two doesn't really, you know, bother me or, you know, do anything that I'm worried about from a cost standpoint. Hope you found this interesting.